Today, we're opening a PSA graded card return, so stay tuned. Hey, I'm Veronica Taylor. I'm here with Justin. Um, and so I wanted to tell you from myself and Ash Ketchum, Justin is the greatest Pokemon master in the world. Subscribe to Pokehood and you can find out. What's good, Pokehood? Today we're doing a PSA graded card return in which I went to Ocala Comic Con to, in Florida last month and I got some cards autographed by Mitsuhiro Arita. And wow, it was quite an experience when I went there. Uh, you might have seen um, SM Pratt's video about the different things that happened at Ocala and, and um, uh, Baltimore when uh, Kuki Saito did his autograph signing too. There was a whole bunch of things, um, unfortunate things that happened. Uh, people, you know, cut in line. There were people who waited outside Arita's hotel to get a signature. It was just, it was a, it was just really crazy. Um, but when I was there, I was able to use my fast pass lane. Uh, I didn't want to wait in line for like eight plus hours, 10 plus hours. So I just did that. Me and my brother went and we got some cards graded. Um, I mean autograph and then graded by PSA. So let's go ahead and open this up in three, two, one. All right, so let's do a little backstory before I reveal the grades. Um, so we both got a couple cards uh, autographed by Arita and we had the choice, you know, what are we gonna get autographed? Uh, my brother went with a, uh, he did two, two raw cards and one graded card. Uh, I, on the other hand, uh, cool story, I'll tell that later, but I bought a PSA 7 Stormfront Charizard and a PSA 7 uh, Charizard from EX Dragon that you know I wanted to crack out and then get them autographed and then get them um, regraded and authenticated. And the other card was a uh, PSA 8 Charizard, base set Charizard, um, unlimited. But yeah, I was um, I cracked them all out and I'll showcase a picture right here. And yeah, so you'll see that there's two sevens and an eight. So keep that in mind later uh, when I showcase these cards. But um, I also was able to get another um, two cards signed, a PSA 9 Charizard that was autographed on the case and then a E3 Pikachu. And yeah, it was a, uh, it was, it's a pretty cool story. I'll, I'll, I'll tell that later, but let's get started with the uh, first card now that we get that out of the way. <clears throat> so this one, oh yeah, that's my brother's. Um, he. This is, is Charizard, base set. Uh, you can see the huge crease there. Uh, he didn't really care. He just wanted to get something signed by Arita, um, one of the more iconic cards. So let's go ahead and reveal. So look at that, that's pretty cool. Um, he did two Pokemon Master and that is pretty unique. Um, there's Arita's Japanese signature, and then the English with the date from Ocala Comic Con, and then a sketch of Charizard. So, one of the one of the most uh, autographed cards by Arita, um, just because Charizard is the most popular, most well known. Um, look at the, it; it's pretty nice. The sketch it really pops out, makes the card really nice. Uh, I know autographed cards are a niche, but you know, I, I love autograph cards. It's just, it tells a great story. Uh, and yeah, uh, let's look at the grade now. So, three, two, one. Oh, nice. So, he got the very good three, but he got the auto 10. So, that's, that's really good. A autograph uh, grade of 10 for a base at Charizard signed by Mitsuhiro Arita. So there's that first one. Let's look at the next one. Uh, 
I think this is one of mine. This might be the Stormfront charger or the Dragon uh, EX Dragon charger. So let's take a look. Oh, oh, oh actually, it's uh, my base hit charger. So this one was the PSA 8 that I showed on the screen earlier. I cracked it out and then I, um, you know, got it signed and got the sketch and everything. And yeah, I re regraded it to get authenticated. Um, so uh, dual service. So let's see what I got. It was a PSA 8. Let's see what happens. In three, two, one. Whoa, oh my goodness. That's crazy. So if you like, I got the, when I cracked it out, it was an eight. Now it's a nine and it's an auto 10. So that's crazy. Look, let's look at the back. So, you know, I could, I could, I could see that there's a little whitening right there, a little whitening right there, some whitening down there, and then the centering is really off top to bottom. So I, I could see a, a justified, but to get a nine, that is crazy. Wow. That, I'm really excited about that one, so. <laughs> Look at that, two autographed Charizards by Mitsuhiro Rita. Now let's go on to the next card. So, okay, this one looks like my brother's uh, other card. So it's pretty, pretty worn on the sides and edges. So let's take a look. Yep, we have here a first edition Shadowless Gyarados. Signed to Pokemon Master, Mr. Hidorita, Japanese, and then the date. So, look at that, that looks pretty nice. Let's see what the grade is in three, two, one. Oh, nice, okay. So, very good to excellent four, and then auto 10. Now, you know, he wasn't really, he didn't really care about the item grade, he just wanted to make sure the the uh, signature was uh, authenticated and it got auto 10. So that, that's uh, that's pretty good. So the next card. Okay, so centering wise, yeah, you can see top to bottom, little little whiting there. Let's see what the card is. And here we go. We got a Stormfront Charizard. No sketch or anything, just the um, signature in Japanese. So this one I cracked out. It was a seven before, and you could, you saw that from the picture earlier. So let's see what grade this got. In three, two, one. Oh my goodness! Look. Oh man, look. It got a nine. So it went from a seven to a nine. Are you serious? Oh. Oh my goodness, that's crazy. So you could definitely tell there's little whitening dots on the top. It is greatly off-centered. Nick down there. I don't even know how this got a nine, um, to be honest. I'm not complaining. Uh, I, I, I was hoping just to get the same grade. So I got a PSA 9 Auto 10 Stonefront Charizard and Wow, I, I'm not even sure what the population of this is. So, this is, I'm pretty sure it's under like 10. PSA 9 Auto 10 Stormfront Charizard. That's crazy. Wow, okay, so, that, that oh, that's awesome. Um, okay, I think this is my E3 Pikachu. You definitely see the edge wear. Yep, uh, I think this is it. Let's take a look. Yep, we got a E3 Pikachu, it's, it's yellow cheeks, but we got the signature and everything. So, wow, let's see what great it is. Three, two, one. Oh, uh, well, you know, I'm not complaining. I knew from the edge wear, you can definitely see edge wear. I would have thought this would be a seven at best. So I'm, 
I'm actually okay with an 8. And, you know, the auto is a 9. It might be because, um, yeah, I could, I could see how the auto is a 9. But other, in any other case, I'm not, I'm not complaining. This is such a great card. E3 promo, signed by Arita. Any autograph card, you know, it's, it's awesome. And here, let's get the last one. As you can guess, this is my EX Dragon Charizard. Uh, it's pretty, not bad in terms of whitening and centering. Uh, let's see. So this one was also a seven. So look how beautiful that Charizard looks. Uh, yeah, so this was a seven, cracked it out and then got it graded. Let's see what the grade is in three, two, one. Oh, same grade, okay. That's okay. We got the same grade, Nearman 7, but the auto was a 9. So, let's take a look. What's the, um, let's take a look. So, it's pretty much the same style, so I'm not sure what prompted this to get a, this one to get a 9, this one got a 10 auto. Um, yeah, not really sure, but, wow. So, let's take a look at the trio of Charizards. So you could see the picture earlier where were these three, uh, two sevens and an eight, got back two nines and a seven. Now that is a great, great uh, regrade, and, which is amazing. Um, so yeah, there we got, we got the E3 Pikachu, Stormfront Charizard, Base Set Charizard, EX Dragon Charizard. My brother got his base set Charizard and a first edition Gyarados. He also get uh, got a, a PSA uh, 9 Moltres, first edition Moltres from Fossil. He got that autographed with the, um, I think there's a sketch on there, but yeah. So, I might be wondering, how was I able to get, uh, so I was able to get five cards graded and so, I mean, not graded, but signed. It's graded, signed, um, yeah. So these were four, but the other one was a, let me uh, grab that real quickly, was a PSA 9 Mint Charizard. This was just on the case. Uh, it's not on the actual card, it was on the case. So I, I was able to get five cards signed. Um, and the reason was, you know, I was wait we were waiting in line for like, a good three, four hours before we were just like, let's just use our fast pass lane. And we did. Um, my brother went first, I went a little later and there was a, uh, a travel nurse that was behind me. And you know, she just started talking about her Funko Pop and she just didn't even know that Rita was gonna be here. And she was only gonna get a Funko Charizard um, signed. And you know, I was like, hey, um, would you be interested in me paying for your your um, signature uh, if you were to get my other two cards signed, which was this one and then the E3 Pikachu? Um, and she agreed, and she was like, "Yeah, sure. You know, I'm not. I don't. I don't mind." So yeah, I paid for her signature. Um, she got these two signed for me, and you know, I even gave her some more, um, an extra. Uh, Twenty dollars, just because you know, it was pretty, really nice of her to do that for me. So yeah, that's how, that's the story. Uh, it's pretty cool. It's uh, you know, it was it was by luck that that happened. Um, and like, if the timing was a little bit different, I wouldn't have gotten all five signed. So I was able to get um, an extra two, one graded and one um, in this E3 Pikachu. So yeah, so that's the story of Okala Comic Con. There was a that was just there's a whole bunch of things that went on there. Um, but in any other case, I'm happy with these return grades. This one, this one's awesome. Um, and the Stormfront Charizard are two nines, auto auto tens. That's amazing. Well, all right, guys. So that'll do it for this video. Um, Please leave a like, comment down below what you 
think about autograph cards and yeah i will catch you guys in the next one peace